Hey guys, Zen up here. One of the biggest questions I've got about the Starlink Mini is how does it stack up against the regular Starlink? So I have a Gen 1 and I have a Starlink Mini. I'm going to set them kind of close to each other and we're going to test out their speeds. We are out where we have the other Starlink at, up on top of our travel trailer mounted there. And right over here we have our Mini hooked up to our battery and our solar panels for power. We have two phones here and we're going to do a speed test at the same time for both dishes. On the left we have the Gen 1 and on the right we have the Mini. We have these on two separate phones running these speed tests. I did speed them up because otherwise this was going to be an extremely long video but we are watching the upload, downloads, latency. Sometimes the Gen 1 wins and sometimes the Mini wins and I really can't explain that except for maybe how much usage is on the satellite that we're talking to at that exact time. Maybe if one starts a hair late later than the other one it might be talking to a different satellite that's crossing over I, mean, I really don't know but this is the results that I got so I don't know let's sit here and watch them for a few seconds Okay, now I decided to put both phones on the Gen 1. I don't know who that was. But both phones are on the Gen 1, and I'm starting them pretty much the exact same time. Uh, they get pretty close, but still, one phone is doing better than the other one sometimes. Sometimes the other one is. And again, no explanation for it except for maybe the one that started first might get a little bit of an edge because it was already talking to the satellites before the other one kicked on and it was the second one so it was getting less internet but it's not always true either so I don't know like this one that one the one that started second had 34 megabytes against 27. I don't know, it's just random. It really is. Here's both phones on the Mini. And this one I could see why whichever one starts second might have less speed just because the first one was first and the Mini's on a roaming plan. Also, somebody else might have started using the internet right when the first phone or the second phone started its test, or maybe somebody kicked off and it allowed one of the phones to get a little bit more speed. I can't find any explanation to why the speeds are different. I thought it might be the phone itself so I will be testing that when these tests are over which will be in just another few seconds or so So here's just one phone on the Mini running, and we get some pretty good speed for it. And here's the second phone after that test was over with, and we still get about the same speed. The upload speed, I think, was a little bit different though. So here I decided to put just one phone on the Starlink app and run the speed test off of that. So here's the Gen 1 speed tests. And you can see we're getting some pretty decent speeds.
But again, it still fluctuates. And now we're doing it for the mini. I switched over the app to the mini. And again, it really, there's no explanation for why. We got 84, 121, and 63. I mean, it was boom, 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 one right after another. Well, that's all I have for this video. Bang around that bell icon if you want to be notified when new videos come out. Call us on the hotline if you have comments or questions and want to be featured in an upcoming video. Don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe. Check us out on the website, and we'll see you guys on the next one.